Lucas Media, shout out to the ones who support me and the ones who hate me. Shakur Stevenson uh, went off on his boss, Bob Arum and Top Rank. Now, Shakur Stevenson does have one more fight with them. Uh, his upcoming fight in June, and then after that, he will be a free agent. Now, Shakur put out a couple of things. Uh, one being it's one tweet saying, Floyd told me years ago, Top Rank don't F with black fighters they just use until they can't use you no more tonight was them trying to make a statement to me bob don't got say no more they just letting him believe he can run it but they taking over his company behind the scenes bunch of sharks who don't really f with bob like that now todd the buff Bob Arum's son is the president of Top Rank, and he's the one who calls uh, the shots. Now, a couple of things I kind of want to break down. Shakur, if you really feel this way, Terrence Crawford been through it, other fighters have been through it, and you could just do your history on Bob Arum and then make your own determination. And then you even said that Floyd put, try to put you on game about it. A man who made 200 plus million dollars a fight towards the end of his career with uh, Pacquiao and um, Conor McGregor. So you got people that you can see and Floyd told you and tried to give you the game and you still sign with top, top rank. That's cool. But then you also got to talk to your management, man. Don't Jay Prince manage you? You got to talk to Jay Prince and then let him work it out with Bob Arum or whoever, you know, or let Jay Prince go to Al Heyman at the PBC to try to get a deal or get their own deal or try to go talk with Eddie Hearn. Like it's all business, man. And you ink the contract. And also, if this is your last fight. Oh, he also deleted a tweet where he said that he hoped they don't. Um, he don't lose. Well, if you go out there, and you dominate, and you stop uh, who you going up against your opponent. You ain't gonna have to worry about that. I'm sorry. I don't really feel sorry for Shakur because you're a world champion. You're still young. And if you feel like you've been cheated this way, you got an opportunity to do it. And also, just look at Floyd again, right? When Floyd flew down there to Rio to potentially sign you, you could have looked at what he did. Your peer, Devin Haney. You can look at what he did, how Devin Haney can jump from network to network. You know, he might do, he did something with Top Rank, but then he did something with Eddie Hearn, but then he got his own promotional company. You got that. But see, more than, a lot of times, these fighters, they just go for the, for the money. But I mean, but like I said, you with Jay Prince, you know what I'm saying? Y'all should be able to uh, figure this out. So I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. I mean, like I said, Shakur, he'll be all right. He's still a millionaire. You know, he'll be all right. Trust me. Somebody going to sign him. <laughs> but I want to get my quick thoughts about it again. Tell me what y'all think.